Yo, this lens for smartphones is crazy. You gotta just press record. Hey, what's up? It's Omar Altakori with Think Media, and I was on Amazon the other day, and I was actually looking for a wide-angle lens for my smartphone. I have a iPhone 13 mini, the cheapest version of the iPhone 13 that you can get, and I wanted to get a wide-angle lens that could be used on the regular camera because that's the camera that has cinematic mode. And also, if you didn't know, most smartphones, they have one superior camera, and usually it's the main camera in the rear, but if you're gonna shoot vlogs or even if you want that wider shot, but you want the best quality possible, your best bet is to actually get a lens for your smartphone. And I absolutely love this lens that I found. It's the Zenvo Pro Lens Kit for any smartphone. And it had almost 14,000 ratings. So I was like, this has to be good. There's also a coupon and you can also shop to use. And we'll be sure to post links down in the description below if you wanna check it out. But this lens would then come in the mail and then I would begin to unbox it. And I was like, holy cow, they have so much going on. It comes with a case, comes with a Bluetooth remote, which is rechargeable and super nice, it has a cap but I didn't even realize that the lens itself was like this big and heavy duty. This lens is legit like pretty heavy and weighty, but it just goes to show how quality the glass is that is in it. And you actually get two lenses with this pickup. You're gonna get the super wide, which is great for vlogging or YouTube videos, or you can even clip it on your you know, laptop webcam and widen the shot as well. Uh, but then when you screw off the wide angle lens, you're actually gonna be met with a macro lens, which is essentially a lens that allows you to get really close to things and get high details if you wanted to shoot something super close up and have it be super crispy clean. And it just looked so impressive and it really just gets me thinking about like all the things you can do with a smartphone nowadays. Uh, it's kind of hard to even tell the difference if you're even using a smartphone. When putting this setup against the Canon M50 with a 16 millimeter lens, this is about an $800 combo. Um, you actually get very similar results, especially when using cinematic mode on the new iPhone 13. And again, I have the 13 mini, which is the cheapest out of all of them. I actually wanted to challenge myself when I was upgrading my smartphone this year and I, I didn't want to get the maxed out you know, version of something. I wanted to get the cheapest version of something and kind of prove a point that you don't need the best you know, smartphone. Uh, whereas I just got the cheapest smartphone being the iPhone 13 mini. However, this setup is super great. What's cool about getting a wide angle lens for your main camera of your smartphone is you increase the quality in low light. You also increase the video quality just all together, but you also increase your audio quality because you have the ability to now bring your phone closer to you, which will improve the audio. Even if you plug in a shotgun mic and maybe you have a shotgun mic setup and you're vlogging, it'll allow you to bring the mic even closer to your mouth and cut out more outside noise, but still give you a wide shot, which is just super cool. And I understand that my phone has the wide angle lens, but when you compare the quality when using it in scenarios outside of the sun, it really doesn't compete with just clipping this lens on. And so I'm actually pretty pumped about this lens. If you actually wanna check out my vlog setup with my smartphone, I actually have a monitor that I use to be able to see myself while using the wide angle lens and the mic I like using best. Be sure to click or tap the screen and I can't wait to see you in a future video. Peace.